All right guys, welcome back to another Moto Vlog. We are on the BMX uh, Zero CC. <laughs> All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. I was hoping my battery don't die because I got one of these wasabi batteries in and I just put a 100% wasabi battery in and then uh, that died somehow and it won't turn back on so I, I'm on my last battery so let's hope this one lasts a little bit so I can get me a little video in. I got a new clutch lever and got a handbrake now. So yeah, that's cool. I'll describe the details in a video where I do a, like a walk around of my bike. But anyways, I got a handbrake set up and I got a new righteous stunt clutch lever. I'm stoked about that. I also got some stiffer springs in there. I remember a while back I was talking about how I installed the man in the box clutch, or clutch place and springs and how I didn't like the springs. Well, now I got a better lever to make it better. And uh, yeah, now I like the springs a little bit. Uh, don't get me wrong, it's still stiff, but... Um, I'll get, I'm already getting used to it, so plus my fingers just gonna get shredded. But yeah, so today I finally started working on double peggers, which is nice. Cause I got that. Ooh, oh, dude, I'm just so excited to be doing handbrake stuff now, it, cause I, I've been stuck on sit downs for so long. Just the handbrake is oh, just it just opened a whole new book of tricks for me, and it's gonna make stunting so much better for me, cause I won't get stressed over not being able to do a trick, and then not have a handbrake to where I can't do any other tricks so and I was always bad with staggers I could never get staggers like every time I try them it's so awkward and I already know I'm not going to be able to get them down so I'm just going to learn uh, double peggers with my handbrake I'm still going to use foot brake for like some stuff but I just need to use my handbrake to get the basics of some stuff if that makes any sense and I'm I know I need to know foot brake which I'm always gonna know foot brake because I feel like I've gotten that down pretty well from sit downs so if I ever want to use my foot brake for like staggers or something I won't have to use my handbrake I'm sure I could do that but I'm gonna just try and get used to my handbrake for most of these stand-up stuff today's like my first day trying stuff with my handbrake I've had the handbrake for a while now Christmas present I've been kind of building it up and it finally works now a few days after Christmas which is perfect um, but yeah so today is my first day actually playing with it and actually attempting stuff and I got some double peggers I got them up pretty good I felt like I got them up to 12 almost just about they do feel so much better than sit downs like I feel like I'm gonna get those down way faster than I ever will on sit downs and I feel like most people do get uh, stands ups and stuff like that a lot faster I'm just stoked to be able to have new tricks or to try new tricks I'm gonna go to the top of the parking garage, chill there, check my phone, see who's gonna be out, who's trying to ride. I also did get me um, some uh, Honda Mini Bars. I did think the Kawasaki Minis and the Honda Minis were the same thing, just different names, but the Honda Minis are a slightly, slightly different bend and uh, they're a little bit taller not as tall as the uh, klx 110s i don't like how tall those are so these uh, honda minis are spot on perfect i i felt i needed to get a uh, bars that were a little bit taller due to uh um handbrake stuff whenever i stood on my rear pegs my bars felt kind of low and it felt kind of awkward so i wanted my bars a tiny tiny bit higher for that purpose and also it just it feels good for wheelies I called TJ. It's a no for him. <laughs> I didn't notice your car. I thought I thought you were just some kid like waiting and just waiting to ask a bunch of questions about my. Huh? I can walk now. Let me see. Have you rode since? I just want to go to the parking garage. Huh? Be careful on it. I'll do a car moto vlog. <laughs> oh yeah, handbrake's new. I finally got it working good today. Alright guys, so we're doing a little moto vlog, car vlog. 
Well, Anton gets on the bike. He uh, recently got hit by a car doing a, or doing a wheelie, but it wasn't his fault. The car was the car like wasn't paying attention, and um, yeah, it was it wasn't really his fault. And but yeah, he had a supermoto and he rode with um, he rides with Mr. Redline a lot. Heck yeah, dude! It's good to see him walking again. Hopefully, he gets a bike soon. I don't know if he's gonna get that DRZ fix or not, but. <laughs> <laughs> you say you know, these don't wheelie very well? Well, I sat on, I rode my buddy's Grom and I said the same thing about his. So I guess it's literally, you just gotta, it's what you're used to. Yeah, I hurts my ankle. I've not been on a bike in so long. It's good to see you walking around though. Nah, it's so much better than the wheelchair. Is that DRZ total at all or? Is it fixable? Forks. Some forks and that's forks, it? Triple tree bars, yeah. I'll be back. Huh? Yeah, no problem. Yes. <laughs> you know from experience, don't you? <laughs> Alright, be safe in that car, man. Don't hit me. <laughs> See ya, bro. Hell yeah, dude. That's good to see an Anton. No cops. See, my sit downs aren't good. I don't know if it's because, I don't know. It's weird. Give everybody a good old ring. All right, let's try a little handbrake action. Oh. Those feel so good, dude. Uh, Oh my gosh, I can't believe I can actually catch it with my brake. Oh. <laughs> oh, the squirrel wants to race. You want to race, baby squirrel? Oh, it's your baby squirrel. I think it's your baby squirrel. It looks like a baby squirrel. Oh, I'm about to drop that one. Whew. Yeah, definitely, you know, getting a better lot and have some homies with me for some tips I don't I honestly feel like I can do um, double peggers and stuff practicing without anybody with me cuz I don't know I feel like you just I don't know it feels like there's not a whole lot of technique to it I feel like you just got to get good at it but there may be some techniques like like I said I've only been wheeling it for a day now so <laughs> Level 250 probably. Called dad. Alright, I had informed my father that I am ready to train my little brother to ride my bike. Or to ride a bike. But um they are out at uh Orange Leaf. So man I tell you what dude it feels so good to ride. I'm trying to ride with somebody like with somebody that likes like Fooligan. Fooligan would be perfect to ride with. Just do wheelies. Fooligan, get your ass over here. It's not even more of like a fan thing anymore. Like I like his videos and everything, but I just like want to ride with him instead of watch the videos. My brakes are squeaking. What's going on over here at my school? Uh, probably football stuff. We're going to ride around a little bit. Can't believe this stuff's open. Imagine me doing a wheelie in my own school. Principal would be pissed. He'd be so pissed. But I don't care. Because he's not here. And I am. And I will do wheelies wherever and whenever and however. Saying hi. Who is caked in cologne, my guy? It's this car up here. He's 
motherfuckers are caked in cologne. I'm going on a date. Oh yeah, it's definitely his car in front of me. It's either heavy cologne or heavy black eyes. Oh yeah, I also did get a new master too. This was my other handbrake, but it didn't work as a handbrake. It didn't work good at all, so I kind of had to uh I didn't have to use it at all, but I decided to try it on the front and it works better than my other one, so. Alright guys, right now we're riding with my brother, he's on the 883. We're gonna go to the lot, uh, a church lot. Not a lot that I usually go to, but we're gonna teach my little brother how to ride. So, I'm gonna end off this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, yeah, like, subscribe, comment, leave feedback if you want. Yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.